Has your doctor recommended a bone marrow biopsy? Bone marrow is tissue inside your larger bones that makes blood cells. It has a soft, spongy part and a liquid part. During a bone marrow biopsy, your doctor removes and tests a small sample of your spongy marrow to see if it's healthy and making blood cells like it should. Results from a bone marrow biopsy help your doctor diagnose cancers and other conditions that affect your blood and bone marrow, tell if cancer has spread to your bone marrow or if a tumor there is growing, or check if your treatment is working, like whether your bone marrow is making enough healthy blood cells after cancer treatment. Your bone marrow biopsy will probably be taken from the back of your hip bone where there are no major nerves. Before your biopsy, your doctor numbs the area, but you may still feel some discomfort. You may also choose to get medicine that helps you relax or stronger medicine to make you sleep during the procedure. Your doctor first makes a small cut in your skin, then inserts a tube-like needle into your bone's marrow. Your doctor uses this needle to take out a small round piece or core of the spongy part of your bone marrow, plus a tiny piece of bone. Before your biopsy, your doctor may also do a bone marrow aspiration to take a sample from the liquid part of your bone marrow. For the aspiration, your doctor inserts a smaller needle with a syringe attached to pull out a sample of the liquid bone marrow. The entire procedure should take about 10 to 20 minutes. Your doctor sends your bone marrow samples to a lab for testing. Ask your doctor any questions you have about your bone marrow biopsy and how to best prepare for it.